Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Very good morning children. Today we are going to learn about unit 6 multiples. Here are the objectives children. Here are the properties of multiples children. A number is multiple of itself. Every number is a multiple of 1. And every multiple of a number is greater than or equal to number itself. And there is no end to the multiples of particular number. What is a multiple, the product of a number and a whole number? We are multiplying a number with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. So there is no end. One example here I have given 7 eights of 56. When I am multiplying the two numbers, I am getting the product. This product is nothing but the multiple of the given numbers. One more example if I see here. 5 fours are 20. So 20 is multiple of both 5 as well as 4. And 5 and 4 they are called factors of 20. Which you have learned already in your previous chapter factors. Yeah. Coming to multiples. So how to find the multiples of a number? Here we are just multiplying the given number by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on. So that we are getting the multiples of the number. Example, multiples of 3. Here I am doing children. 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6, 3 3s are 9, 3 4s are 12 and so on like this. I am getting the multiples of 3 as 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18 and so on. One more example if I take here. 4 also I am multiplying by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. There is no end for the multiples. Okay. So that I am get, getting the answers. The multiples of 4 as 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24 and so on. In this way you should write in the copy book children. One more example if I take. What are the first 5 multiples of 13? So 13 times 1 is 13, 13 times 2 is 26, 13 times 3 is 39, 13 times 4 is 52, 13 times 5 is 65. So the first 5 multiples of 13 are 13, 26, 39, 52 and 65. Here are the missing multiples children. Yeah. Now, to find out whether one number is multiple of another, so we will divide the number and we'll find out. If our remainder is 0, then we can say that it is a multiple of the previous number. For example, 32, if I am dividing by 4 here, okay, I am getting coefficient as 8 and remainder as 0. So, I can say that 32 is multiple of 4 as well as 32 is multiple of 8. So, few more examples if you have, if you are considered children. You have to divide the number. So, 12 here by 3. 12 divided by 3, I am getting remainder as 0 and coefficient as 4. So, I can say that 12 is multiple of 3 as well as 4. In this example also, 77, if I divide by 11, I am getting remainder as 0. And I can say that 77 is multiple of 11 as well as 7. So connecting to the factors and multiples here are the examples children. 2 is a factor of 16 but 16 is a multiple of 2. Similarly 3 is a factor of 21 but 21 is a multiple of 3. 5 is a factor of 45 but 45 is a multiple of 5. Please Find the difference between what is a multiple and what is a factor. Coming to the new topic here children, it is common multiples. To find the common multiples of the given two numbers. First we have to find the multiples of the given numbers. So I am taking an example as the multiples of 2 and 3 I am taking children. So here the multiples of 2 are 2, 4, 6, 8 and so on. Next the multiples of 
3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 and so on. So what you can see here to find the multiples of 2 and 3 together if you are writing we can see that 6 is common here. 6 is common and if you move further 12 is common. So there is no end to the common multiples as well. So the question here given is find the first two common multiples of 2 and 3. So here by looking at this example we can say that the first two common multiples of 2 and 3 are 6 and 12. Similarly we can find the common multiples of 2 and 3 on the number line. So for that you have to draw a line on that line. The numbers should be marked from 0 to infinity. It depends. So here coming to the multiples of 2, we are keeping the arrows like this children. 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4, 2 3s are 6, 2 4s are 8, 2 5s are 10, 2 6s are 12 and so on. Taking, If you are taking the multiples of 3, 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6, 3 3s are 9, 3 4s are 12 and so on. So now to find the common multiples, what we are observing in the number line children, that both the multiples of 2 and multiples of 3, they are coinc coincide here. They are intersecting at this particular fixed point here. So 6, they are, both the arrows are connecting. The same way the next connecting point is 12 and the next connecting point is 18. So what we can observe in the number line children, the common multiples of 2 and 3 are 6, 12, 18 and so on. But we want only the first two common multiples then we can say that the answer is 6 and 12. To represent these common multiples of 2 and 3 in the circle diagram, in this way we can represent children. So multiples of 2 separately in one circle and multiples of 3 separately if you write in another circle. What we can observe in both the circles we have 6, 12, 18 as common. So we will join these two circles children and we can represent the common multiples in this intersection point here. Here is the homework for you children. Thank you, children.